Thomas the Tank Engine and Friends, Wind Railway Adventures on the Island of Sodor, Episode 10. Bye-bye, Fat Hat. Sir Topham Hat has always been a bad driver of Winston ever since he's purchased Winston. Whoa! Whoa! Careful now, sir. Whoa! Whoa! And always after the mishap, Winston would always say, It's always early days, sir. Yeah, I know, said Sir Topham Hat. But I wish I could be better at driving you. Well, let's take off again. Whoa! Soon, Sir Topham Hat arrived at Tidmit Sheds. All right, everyone, let's get to work today. We have to all pull our respective trains and do a good job and not have any incidents happen. I'm looking at you, Percy. Oh, sir, why do you have to do that to me? I'm just checking, Percy, because I can't afford all these crashes all the time. I know, said Percy. Oh, and by the way, Edward? Yes, sir, said Edward. Today you have a substitute driver because I talked to your driver and he says he's not feeling well. Oh, okay, sir, said Edward. Oh, I hope he'll be nice. So do I, said Sir Topham Hat. All right, everybody, let's get to work. All the trains were waiting at Natford Station for the engines. Gordon puffed in to take the express. Henry puffed in to take his log cars. Percy had the cargo cars. And Edward, with his substitute driver, had some freight cars. All aboard, let's go, said Gordon. Here we go. And he puffed away. I got my log cars ready to take to the forest, said Henry, and he puffed away. And I'm off to the docks to deliver these cargo cars. Percy soon puffed away with a mishap with the trucks. I can't start you up, whatever your name is, he said to Edward. Why not? Because your engine's too old. I've been controlling diesel for my whole life, running them around their railways. I have no idea how to run you. Well, I'm sorry, sir, but what am I supposed to do about that? How about you just go to the scrapyard? Edward was horrified. Oh, I miss my driver. Soon, Edward puffed away as his driver had found out how to control him. So Topham Hat and Whiston were on their way around the island to check and make sure of everything. Whoa! Okay, Ellsbridge Station looks good. Okay, sir, let's keep going. Whoa! Uh, sir, can we go yet? No, I'm making sure that no engines are coming. I don't want to derail you, you old heap of scrap. Edward didn't like that talk. Well, Hilltop Station looks good, Sir Topham Hat said to Winston. Sure does, sir. I like the look of it. So do I, said Sir Topham Hat. Whoa! Edward was just taking off from the signal points when... Whoa, look out, Winston! Ah! And Sir Topham Hat and Winston and Edward were derailed. Harvey had arrived to help, but he was waiting because Sir Topham Hat and the substitute driver were talking. I could have been killed! What were you thinking when you were driving, Winston? Uh, I, I'm sorry, sir. But I can't really drive Winston so great. You can't drive him well? Well, then why are you even driving him, period? 
because he's my inspection car and I need to inspect the railways. Well, I could have been killed. I mean, look, this engine is on the ground now. Sir, can you help me? I will, Edward. Well, you, you need a punishment. You're coming to court with me. Sir Topham Hatt was shocked. I can't come to court with you. I have a railway to run. No, no. I have a friend that used to own a railway, but it closed down. He'll be your replacement. You're coming to court with me. Oh, no. No, why is this happening? Ha, 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 ha. It's all going by plan. Soon it will happen. But the first step is done. It's done and it's over with. And it will just come. It will come, I tell you. It will come. Later that night, Sir Topham Hatt came to Tidmit Sheds to tell all the engines about what happened. Well, engines, I'm going to be gone for a while. What? said Thomas. Why are you going? Where are you going? Number one, I'm going to the mainland for a court case. And number two, I don't even know if I'm going to come back. Why are you going to a court case, sir? said Gordon. Because Edward derailed today. He had the substitute driver. And he filed a lawsuit on me because I can't drive Winston. That's absurd, sir, said Duck. He can't do things like that. I'm afraid he can, Duck. I'm afraid he can. So tomorrow I will be leaving to the mainland and, your, and the new runner of the island for a while, possibly even forever, will come soon. Sir Topham had walked away shamefully to his house. Whoever filed the lawsuit is not going to get away with this. And by the way, where is Edward? Edward's at the works getting repaired, said Winston, as he replied to Boko's question. Well, he better come back, because I have a bad feeling in my boiler that something wrong is going to happen. So do I, said Toby. And I don't think it's a good feeling. Neither do I, said Duck. Let's just watch out. Well, I'll see you guys tomorrow to say farewell to Sir Topham Hat and see who our new controller is. Good night, everybody. And all the engines went to sleep, not looking forward to tomorrow, and hoping that Sir Topham Hat would return.